Hot up on this developing story. Police are still hunting for the gunman who shot this off-duty sheriff's deputy who's just spending an evening in the gas lamp. Yeah, they're expected to release surveillance video today. 10 News reporter Mimi Alcala is live in the gas lamp, and Mimi, police say they do have some good leads this morning. Brian, Virginia, that's right, they do. So the off-duty deputy was shot right over there behind that black car on that sidewalk. And you know, this entire area was crowded with people because that Metallica concert had just let out. So a lot of people were down here. So police do have a lot of witness statements to work with. But another key piece of evidence that they do have to work with are these surveillance cameras that are planted outside of these businesses here um, in the gas lamp area, pointing directly across from where that shooting happened, which means they're giving police a really clear view of the entire incident. Now, police say they're looking for the two men they spotted in that video, but focusing mainly on the man with the gun. The shooter left off duty Deputy Jason Philpott and another innocent bystander in the hospital when he started firing off his revolver after a confrontation here on Island Avenue. Although both men are expected to be OK, the search for the shooter will not rest. All day Monday, police and deputies comb through the gas lamp, searching for any evidence leading them closer to that man. Today, they plan to release that surveillance video, a key piece of evidence so the public can help track down the person responsible. And he kind of took off into the crowd that way. And I'm not sure how far he went down because yeah, I didn't see it. I didn't, I didn't see how far he went down because he kind of lost him in the crowd. So with all the different video from around these different businesses, police are hoping they can track down the path that that shooter ran in. Once we have a piece of that video or even a picture of that suspect, we will bring that to you. For now, we're live in the gas lamp. Mimi Alcala, 10 News. Cameras are everywhere these days. Thank